What is a domain name? As you know, to go to someone's website, you type an address into your web browser or click a link that takes you there automatically. That takes you inside the domain name system, or the DNS for short. Just as you dial a unique set of numbers inside a central telephone system so your phone call makes the correct connection, the DNS lets your computer, cell phone, or mobile device connect with its intended website or email address. And like the phone company, the DNS uses a unique string of numbers called IP addresses, IP standing for Internet Protocol, to make the connection. But most of us don't have to bother with IP addresses because we have easy-to-use domain names instead. For example, the IP address for ICANN's website is 192.0.3.2.7. But the website's domain name, ICANN.org, is much easier to remember. And that's why the DNS was created, to translate IP addresses into unique, easy-to-remember addresses called domain names. There's one important thing you should know about the parts of a domain name to the right and left of the last dot. In example.org, the org to the right of the dot is called a generic top-level domain, or GTLD. There are also CCTLDs, which are country codes like .us for United States and .jp for Japan. Example, to the left of the dot, is called a second-level domain. You'll want to remember this distinction next time you register a domain name. You can learn more about that in our next tutorial.